Hey guys, it's Shani and I'm back today with another plan with me. And for this week's spread, I'm using this kit from Two Little Bees. And I haven't used a kit from Two Little Bees in I feel like forever. So I was excited to use this kit. Um, I feel like in my actual planner, I ended up using two spreads that were very similar in colors back to back. Like I used this one as well as a Crafts by Towie one and they both had like a black and pink thing going so I feel like I was kind of just super over the colorway <laughs> um, but I still really like this kit and I thought it was cute so I wanted to I don't know still use all my leftovers and I had so much in this kit I did get the larger kit uh, since I wanted some of like the cute boxes on the other pages and yeah that was kind of my reasoning there also fun fact I was FaceTiming my cousin uh, while I was filming both this spread and the next spread that's in this planner. So not the next spread that you'll see, but the next spread that's in this planner. Um, she like called me a few minutes into me starting and I was like, okay, well, I'll just leave you in the corner and you can kind of, you know, we can talk and <laughs> you can watch me film, which is obviously so exciting. <laughs> Anyways, uh, in my sidebar here, I used this full box that I had left over that kind of said fashion with some of the clip art elements as well. And then underneath it, I used this kind of like lace divider or header from Honey Inked. I used a habit tracker from this kit and then I used a header from the kit as well. And then um, I didn't have, or actually I did, I had some to-do headers in the kit, but I thought if I could get these to work as headers, um, I thought it would be cute because it kind of made like bow headers and they were foiled. So I was like, that's awesome. Um, so it was basically a full box that just had like seven rows of bows and I was able to cut it down to get headers. And I mean, I didn't cut them perfectly. If you look super closely, they are definitely different sizes, but I did my best. And I think overall, like it's not you know, catching my attention too much. I'm not like shocked by it and notice it immediately. So I feel like it's totally fine. Um, after that, I used some bow date dots from my shop, um, pretty much as always in this planner, unless the kit has some. And I did use gold foil, as you can see for this spread, because that's what the kit was foiled in. Um, so I just stuck with it. And then in my habit tracker here, I just wrote read because I was trying to do some reading or maybe, or maybe I wasn't. I think that was supposed to say study because this was the week before my finals. I think once I finished finals, I started kind of trying to read um, every day or as often as I could. So that's my mistake, but <laughs> it is what it is. Anyways, Monday I marked that I had a quiz in my pathophysiology class. I used this laptop that says like 8 a.m., or I guess it doesn't have to be 8 a.m., but that's kind of what I take it as. <laughs> um, and I just kind of marked the quiz that way. And then I watched 90 Day Fiance this day. So I used, uh, she had a ton of these like scalloped labels and I thought they were super cute. So I used a bunch of them you'll see throughout the spread. And the TV bow icon is from my shop. And then I had a dentist appointment this day. So I used a alarm clock icon from Planning World and used an Ava kind of like relaxing to mark having a lazy day. Then Tuesday, I had a plan with me go live. So I used one of these really cute little like foiled bows to mark that. And then I marked that I had to write and mail a check. So I used a credit card doodle from my shop. I don't know if the credit cards exactly make sense because it, I mean, not really, but <laughs> that's okay. We'll pretend that it's like my debit card and the check is coming out of there so we're just we're gonna go with it um, and I marked that on top of a quarter box from the kit and then I had a Zara package come in so I used this scallop circle from the kit with a package doodle from my shop and then I also used a lap uh, laptop a latte bow icon to mark that I grabbed Starbucks with one of my girlfriends um, and then filling everything out on Wednesday, I did have a doctor's appointment, um, so I kind of just used a, you'll see me put it down in a second here, but 
Um, I used another one of these scalloped uh, like little labels. You can kind of see the scallops here, but since it's a gray uh, like color, it's a little harder to see, but it is there. And then the stethoscope that I used is the doodle one from my shop. I had another plan with me and go live and I marked it the same way as I did on Tuesday. And then I had to meet with my clinical supervisor to kind of go over, you know, her like last comments and my last comments, talk about how the semester went, so on and so forth. I felt really bad. She had COVID. Um, we met on Zoom, by the way, I should mention. <laughs> um, but yeah, she had COVID. So she was feeling like very, very sick. And I felt really bad that she still had to meet with all of us. So she tried to keep it brief. Um, and, you know, obviously I tried to keep it brief for her sake as well. But um, I thought that was really nice that she still decided to like meet with us and, you know, all that fun stuff. Um, I marked it with this clipboard sticker, which is from the deco from the kit. And so is that uh, coffee cup that I used on the third box underneath it. And the third box is from the kit too. I got Starbucks with two of my girlfriends this day. Um, so I kind of just marked it that way. And then Thursday I slept in and I also really wanted to use this like um, sleep mask sticker. And so it was perfect that I saw. I was like, did I nap this week? Did I sleep in? And then I looked at my spread and saw that I marked sleeping in on Thursday, which I don't mark all the time. So I was like, that is phenomenal because I can use this really cute um, like deco sticker. <laughs> And then I had to make a call to PayPal because I was having some like issues with my account and stuff. Somebody had told me that um, they couldn't use PayPal to shop um, like on my shop. So I like contacted them and was like, hello, what's going on? <laughs> um, and thankfully they resolved it pretty quickly. Um, but I just marked it with some stickers from the kit, like that scalloped corner as well as that like speech bubble. And then I had my Sephora VIB sale order come in, which is getting Sephora packages is always so exciting. I mean, getting any packages is exciting. And I've been doing a lot of online shopping, like everything. So I love getting makeup and like skincare in the mail though. Cause I'm like, Ooh, I want to do, you know, I want to redo my makeup even if I don't have it on, but always fun. I marked it with another scalloped circle and the lipstick is a doodle from my shop. And then I marked studying with a flag from the kit. And then Friday, I marked that it was my parents' wedding anniversary with this like label question mark. I don't know, but it has a cute little flag and I used a balloon doodle from my shop on top of it. And then I marked doing some yoga and meditation with a yoga Ava. Um, I then did some filming this day. So I used the camera bow icon that's foiled from my shop. And then I marked that I got a COVID test on Friday. I mentioned in my last uh, plan with me that I had a little COVID scare. Thankfully, I tested negative um, and haven't had anything, you know, that like worried me since. But I was definitely freaking out a little bit <laughs> uh, this day. So, well, actually, it was the night before. By the time this day came, I was like, oh, gosh, my symptom is completely gone. It was definitely allergies. So, you know, but I decided to go and just get tested in case. So I marked it with this to do arrow from the kit. And then Saturday was my shop anniversary, five freaking years, which is so freaking crazy. I like can't believe it. Um, I'm hoping to do new releases next Friday. I haven't announced it anywhere and I'm not a hundred percent set on the date, but I'm hoping to be able to get everything done by then. So for those of you that watch my plan with me is definitely you got the little like sneak peek first snow. <laughs> so definitely keep an eye out. I think it's June 4th, um, if I'm not mistaken. But yes, so I didn't really do anything for my anniversary, but it was still super exciting. Um, I cannot believe I'm still doing this five years later. If you had asked me five years ago when I opened my shop, if I thought I'd be doing it five years later, I'm like, there is no way that sticker planning is still going to be a thing in five years. But I mean, here we are and I definitely love it even more <laughs> than I did back then. So that's exciting. Um, but anyways, I marked it with these two, like, I don't even know what shape that is. Like, gosh, I'm not even going to try these like shape stickers. I layered two of them together and then I used a planner that was from the deco in the kit and a swoosh that's foiled from my shop. 
um, and kind of layered all those together. I think that turned out really cute. And then I marked studying this day with um, a scalloped label from the kit as well as the laptop and the deco sticker are from the kit. And then the tiny bow that I added to the laptop is from my shop. And then I got my negative result this day and saw my cousin in the evening. Um, I think we got some Wendy's, which love. <laughs> so I used a flag from the kit and this burger icon is a really old one from my shop that's not available anymore, but I couldn't think of what else to use and I haven't used that in a while and I thought it was cute. Then Sunday, I did some self-care in the morning. This was the day before my final started. So I was like, I need to kind of, you know, pamper myself uh, to get a, like to get ready for the week ahead. Um, and I marked it with a candle bow icon from my shop. And I also layered it behind this other sticker from the kit, which I mean, you can't really see at all. So I'm not sure exactly what the point of layering that was, but pretend, pretend you know, just pretend it did something. Um, and then I FaceTimed my family this day, so I marked it with another scallop sticker and an Ava that's like FaceTiming. You can see it. I mean, it's kind of hard to tell on video, but she's holding a phone and there's like a person in the, in the screen. <laughs> and then I marked studying the rest of the day with another like laptop and a pen. Both are from the deco from the kit. And then I just kind of capped off the day with a leaf divider that's from my shop and that is the regular size, not the mini. Um, and I just wanted it to take up some space there. But yeah, uh, that was pretty much it for this video. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. I feel like pink and gold is so classic, you know, classic planner girl, but I hope you guys liked it. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.